Hello friends, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new here. Today I'm sharing with you my collection of vintage sleepwear. So I actually had all of these packed away in my closet for a long time now, but I recently just found this black one within the past few months and then it prompted me to dig the rest of them out. I actually had forgotten that I had so many. And the reason they were packed away is because I, I used to wear them sometimes or some of them, but then eventually they just fell apart probably from being so old and washing. And so then I, stopped wearing them because I didn't want to ruin them but they're also now just sitting in my closet in a box for a few years so I don't know I forget what the saying is exactly but like use the nice things you know you could be like gone tomorrow so I've decided to pull them out decide which ones I wanted to keep and then uh, I probably will sell some other ones, but I'm going to actually start wearing them, I think, because why well, have something if you can't use it? So, and then if they fall apart eventually, it's okay. I use them and love them. So anyway, I thought I would share them with you in this quick video. I decided just hanging them on the back of the door would be the best way I could show them to you. So hopefully this works out. It is a very gloomy day, so lighting is not ideal but I'm doing my best. So the black one I just mentioned, I just recently found this one within the last couple of months. It's actually the first time I've seen one in a really, really long time, but I didn't already have a black one and I liked it. It has these cute little flowers that are a little bit kind of worn down from probably being so old, but I really liked it. Um, like I said, I didn't have a black one already, so I think I'm definitely gonna keep this one. Then I have this white one. I've had this one for a long time. This one's kind of plainish. It's a really long one. It comes kind of almost down to your ankles, but it just has a little bit of lace at the top, and then it's just short-sleeved with the little, it's like a ruched sleeve. I don't know if that's the right word or not, but, and it just has a little bow on it. I think I'm going to keep this one too. This one is one of my favorite pieces. It's kind of like a little, I think they call them bed jackets. Um, it's kind of like a turquoise color. It has a little, I love the detail in the like lace around the sleeves and the top and then it just has um, a little tie at the very top around the neck, but you can like wear it over any of your other like nightgowns, which it matches a bunch of the ones that I have really well. It's just, I don't know, very, very like pretty it, it gives me 1960s vibes then we have this sleeveless uh light blue nightgown it's kind of plainish but this one's really long too it comes like down to the floor um and then it just has a little bit of like sheer kind of lace at the top it's like sheer at the very top and then just a little bit of lace and a bow like most of them i do really like this one this one's super comfortable I think I have like 10 in total. I'm trying to narrow it down to maybe five because um, I think that's like a realistic number. So then we have this light pink one, which this one's kind of plainish too, I guess you could say. It's um, kind of like mid-length, I guess. Uh, this one is actually one of the few that actually has a tag, but it's just short, short sleeved with a little bit of lace detail and a bow and the brand is cup and saucer this kind of reminds me of like 80s um i think this one is one of the last ones i picked up before i had packed them away because i had forgotten about it but it is one of my favorites as soon as i saw it i remembered finding it but it has a like very intricate kind of lace detail like in the middle i don't know i just think it looks pretty and it's different than any of the other ones that I have and then it has more lace that goes right up the kind of strap but just, I love this one so I do really want to keep this one this pink one is another one of my favorites I can't really decide between this one and the one I just showed you but it has like a bunch of ruching detail and then a bunch of like lace that's just more intricate and I really love the color and it's super comfortable. I'm definitely going to keep this one. 
it's kind of cinched in at the waist too, which I think looks really pretty. Then we have another pink one, which I do think is really pretty, but the material on this one feels a lot more, um, I want to almost say like scratchy, like it's a firmer material, so it's not as comfortable, And but it is really, really pretty, but I think I will probably end up selling this one, even though I do like it and it's super pretty, it's just like more scratchy and less comfortable, so, but it is, uh, it does have a lot of like lace detail and like kind of ruffle there and a bow like all of them but and it's quite long but yeah it just has like a scratchiness to it that I don't enjoy so this blue one is another one of my favorites this gives me Trudy from Mad Men vibes I feel like she had the best like sleepwear on the show actually I liked her clothes the best out of all the characters but I just love this one so much it's has like a sheer over part and on the sleeves and then there's just another part underneath um that makes it not sheer but I just think it's really pretty it is super short though the bow on this one is in pretty rough shape probably from being so old this kind of gives me 60s vibes as well I do like how the lace is on the bottom of this one as well though Then we have this white piece. I feel like this is an, um, one of the more recent ones before I packed up because I didn't remember having this one either. Um, I think there's like a certain name for this style, but I can't think of it right now. But this would be very good in the summer when it's hot because it's <laughs> not made of much. But um, I might get rid of this one though because I feel like it didn't fit me. So like the torso part doesn't seem very long. But... I don't know maybe I'll keep it but it's not like one of my favorites so I feel like I will probably end up selling it and then lastly we just have this two-piece um, pale yellow set here um, so these are both really long too like down to the floor so there's a like over I guess like I don't know it, it doesn't really feel like a robe but I guess it would kind of be a robe over the top they're both this exact same color and then underneath is just a like spaghetti strap nightgown that's the same length so right down to the floor I think this one is really pretty too but um if I'm remembering correctly it's very very tiny like the waist part is super tiny um, so I don't know if it fit me or not, but I think I have worn the over like robe part with another different nightgown in the past, but I can't remember. I do really like the lace on this one though. It's pretty. So I thrifted all of these just from regular thrift stores. I think they're probably between three and four dollars a piece, but that is it for my collection. I just wanted to share. I think I've shared some of them in haul videos like way, way back in the day probably, but anyway, um, I'm doing a bunch of spring cleaning, so that prompted me to get them out and decide what to do with them and they're so pretty I wanted to share them in a video so I did anyway thank you so much for watching and have a good day